The festive surprise update has just come out in GTA Online, and as you know, some new robberies have also been released, so we're going to be doing a walkthrough for one of them right now. They're honestly a ton of fun to do. I really, really enjoy doing them. But uh, very first thing we got to do is just uh, send this thing back to storage and call up our oppressor because it'll make things a little bit easier. So I saw something somewhere. Apparently, we're going to be able to keep these vehicles for ourselves instead of having to sell them. If we're able to do that, that'll be pretty awesome. All right, so it looks like we got three new robberies right here. Holy shit, okay. Wow. Uh, I mean, obviously, we have to go for the Thrax, right? 405k, let's do that one. Here we go. Which one are we doing? The Podium Robbery. We are heading to the casino, baby. I really wish there was a way to turn off snow, though. Because uh, in just a little bit, you will see why it is so damn annoying. And my oppressor is nowhere to be found. I love when that happens as well. Isn't it great? What's going to end up happening is we're going to be chilling. And then out of nowhere, it's going to become really, really foggy. And it's like a blizzard or something. And you can't see shit. All right, let's go take some pictures of shit. Send that over to Jamal. Beautiful. And then just snap a quick photo of the music locker. Or uh, the door next to the music locker, which I honestly never knew existed until right now. Oh, now we got to go inside. Oh. Okay. Well, let's hope the cops just don't care at all. Hello, Mr. Cop. You somehow didn't notice me on the flying bike. All right. That's great to know. You guys are amazing at your jobs. That was easy. And somehow I managed to fall over while trying to get on my oppressor. All right. Back to the salvage yard we go. I'm assuming we're going to have to do like five mandatory preps for this one. Yep. We have to do five. Okay. Well, let's go get uh, some disguises, shall we? And while we make our way over here, why don't you guys take a look at this video sponsor. If you need any assistance in any of your favorite games like GTA 5, Fortnite, Forza, Call of Duty, and many, many more, be sure to check out damn mods down below in the description, and at checkout, use code FROLICS to get up to $100 off your order. Oh, I see a lot of bitches that we need to kill. Destroy the sewage tankers. Okay. Perfect. Turn the release valves. Oh, there's so many of them. What are you gonna do with a hammer, bro? What do you think you're doing? Okay, these guys got guns. Or, no, that's just a security guard. Oh, shit. Somebody's got a shotgun. Okay, the police have arrived. No, I don't want to climb back down the ladder. I hate when that happens. You either consistently keep climbing back down the ladder or won't let you climb down the ladder at all. What the hell just happened? There we go. We just don't want to get killed by the cops right now. Or else they're going to impound the oppressor. All right, and that is all of the valves. Don't you dare kill me. No, I don't want to die. No, wait for the LSDS van to arrive. Okay. What are you guys going to do with crowbars? Oh, shit. The oil tanker. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Get in before it blows up. Get in before it blows up. Hold. Okay. Okay. It didn't blow it up. Bro, I hate the snow. Holy crap. It's been like literally 13 minutes we've been playing GTA since snow came out, and I already hate it so much. Beautiful. And we have delivered it. All right. Let's go grab ourselves a storage key card. Search Mirror Park for the valet's home. Haha. -ha, there it is. Just for everybody who doesn't know, it's like right here on the map. Locate the valet. Hey, buddy. I have a candy cane. Yeah, you can try some of my candy cane. I am beating this man senseless right now. Holy crap. Okay. I thought that we had to intimidate him. No, he dead dead. Locate the safe. I'm assuming the safe is going to be in his bedroom. Yes, it is. And there's the key card. How do I fall off my oppressor from that, but I can crash into a pole and I'm fine. By the way, I'm not sure if any of you guys have even done this robbery at this point, but I mean, I probably should have done it a little bit earlier. But I just really felt like sleeping because I was up to like 2.30 last night. Literally just had a whole movie marathon. It was awesome. Candy can't wait. I got a snowball launcher, didn't I? Oh, ho, ho, look at this thing. Oh, and it has infinite snowballs. Bro, it's like a freaking stun gun. That's awesome. Yo, that's sick. I like that. I really like that. All right. So the mandatory preps for that part are done. Now we just got to do the free mode ones. So let's head back outside. One thing I really like about these missions is they are actually so easy to do. Like, they're literally just mini heists with a fraction of the payout, but you get a good amount of money, and they don't take long. I don't care, Tom Connors. I'm able to rob your freaking casino, bro. Hello, firefighter. I found your gas masks. Oh, wait, no, that's a collectible. Okay, y'all y'all want beef. Okay, well, I got a candy cane, bitch. Bitch. Stay down. Yeah, run away. Get scared of my candy cane. Bye-bye. Oh, for God's sakes. Okay, that's twice now I've done that by crashing into a random lady and falling off my oppressor. We gotta go collect money from our nightclub. 250k is sitting in there. It's actually been sitting in there for a little bit. All right, where's the next closest one? Oh, we gotta go all the way up there. Isn't there another one that's like close down here somewhere? I'll eventually find it. It's always so weird flying when there's snow. Like, look at the bushes and the trees. Like, they look so weird. Like, obviously, they're not loaded in properly because we're so high up. All right, break into the hideout. I'm assuming we're going to need a gun for the... Oh, they refilled all my ammo. Well, I like that. Let's take out this thing then. 
haven't used this in so long. I really should just go and restock on my Mark II ammo every once in a while. Because whenever I run out, I just kind of never refill it. Okay. Somebody is about to get blown to pieces right now. That's how you murder a bunch of bitches. Oh look, one more. Here, you can have a normal gun, just for you. Alright, and now for that quick 30 second mission, we gotta drive or fly all the way back to the city. And I can't see shit. Imagine you had to drive all the way there and all the way back. Like that's like a 5.5 mile drive there and a 5.5 mile drive all the way back through the snow. And all we did was just fly up in the air and then, yeah, kind of just pull back on our analog stick every once in a while to stay up. And that is pretty much it. Gotta love it. There should be one more that we have to do. Yeah, we have to do one more. Where is that one more? It's literally not showing up on the map anywhere. Okay, maybe we have to start it from inside actually. Oh, it started inside. Okay, so we actually just got to go inside the casino to start it up. All right, bet. So we're going to go plant an explosive device inside of a casino. Plant explosives in any toilet stall. Oh god, we're about to bomb the bathroom? Well, I don't even need explosives. Perfect. All of the tasks have been completed. We are now ready to start up this uh, heist, I guess. Come on, big money. Why is the wheel lagging? Oh, did we hit it? I think we hit it. Nope, we hit clothing. Why am I wearing this outfit? I hate trench coats in GTA 5. They look so weird. Why do they stick to like my thighs? By the way guys, so far it's taken about 35 minutes and 40 seconds to complete these preps. So I'm um, thinking maybe another 15 minutes and that's the entire thing in the bobber done. All right, just uh, stop talking. Perfect. Let's start this robbery. Look at this thing freaking drift. Stop. Stupid snow. Oh my god, it's so annoying to control. Let's detonate the bomb, baby. Alright, collect the rappel equipment. How you doing, sir? We're just here to clean up the toilets. Heard that somebody, uh, bombed them. Don't know exactly what that means, to be honest. Could be an explosive device, or it could just be some explosive diarrhea. I really want to take my candy cane. What the shit is- That's disgusting. I don't want to clean that. Bro, that's nasty. No. Alright, guard. Go ahead and leave, because what we're doing here is definitely cleaning. It's actually working. What the Okay, then. Apparently, this mop can literally just suck up everything. All right. I'll just walk over here. How you guys doing? Don't mind me, even though you can clearly see me. But apparently, you can't see far enough. Might need some glasses there, buddy. It is dark. Holy crap. All right. This is where the elevators are. Why can't we get in there? Okay, I alerted the casino. I don't care. Okay, at least the lights are on now. What the shit, bro? Bitch? It's right here? Okay. Damn. The casino is not that tall. Oh, this is cool. Perform a long jump. Okay, that's a short jump. Yo, this is dope. Bro, we've never done this before. This is actually kind of cool. I like these missions, bro. These missions are actually kind of fucking awesome. Oh, I guess it's just like some high roller or something that was like at the casino. Oh, sh oh shit. I was literally not even looking at the guards. I'm just looking at all the cars. Oh, this thing again. Okay. Um, and just like that, I we did it. Perfect. All right. All right. Do we just hop on the whip now? You know, the Thrax is actually looking pretty nice. So these are, are the podium vehicles. Once somebody wins one, they toss a freaking Bugatti on there. Security doors are locked. Of course they are. Okay. Let me just take cover for a second. Regen it for a bit. There we go. Get that health up. That's good enough. I don't need that much health. Okay. I know you're still there. Oh, damn, you can get shot through that, huh, bitch. 5241, where's 5241? Right there. Right here, boom. Wow, that was easy. You know, for security, they're pretty shit. Like, I'm just one dude. Like, how can you actually be that bad? That's kind of surprising to me. One thing I really like about this is, uh, it doesn't matter how much damage you do to the car. So, uh, we can pretty much just drive freely and not have to worry about anything. And we still get paid the full amount, except when we sell it. And that took 15 minutes. Total of 49 minutes so far. We just got $10,000. Sadly, we did not complete any of the challenges, except uh, we didn't die, which is a good thing. All right, well, uh, let's sell this thing off. $405,000 profit. This should be a, about a two-minute mission here. We should be able to just get there easily with no issues. That's another good thing about owning this salvage yard. What did I just get 50 k for? Oh, for completing the podium robbery. Sweet. All right, but we got 405 k We didn't damage the car whatsoever. And just like that, the Thrax has been delivered. It's covered in snow, though, but it's fine. And there we go. 51 minutes, 53 seconds to complete it. That's honestly not bad. I mean, we were taking our time and kind of just chilling. But uh, boom, look at that. $405,000. Beautiful. All right, well, I guess that's going to wrap things up. Honestly, all in all, I really enjoyed doing this uh, heist contract, whatever it's called. I don't know. It was actually kind of fun. I liked the uh, rappelling in the casino. That was honestly pretty cool. 
But I do want to test out the other ones and see what we got to do there. So, with that said, I guess I will catch you guys in the next walkthrough because there should be another one coming out very, very soon. But anyways, thank you so much for watching and I will catch you guys in the next one.